Elon Musk joins us. He is the CEO of Tesla Motors. His electric cars reached a milestone this weekend. Two Teslas drove from Los Angeles to New York in 76 hours. The Model S sedan, nicknamed Thunder and Lightning, sell for $71,000 each. The car is fueled only by electric power from Tesla's new supercharger stations across the country. They provide a quick charge, lasting hundreds of miles. We're pleased to welcome Elon Musk for an interview you'll only see on CBS this morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So what, how did the cars do, first of all? Uh, they, they did very well, actually. They, they completed the journey despite multiple road closures and blizzards, and in some cases traversing 12 inches of snow, mm. uh, and uh, no, no problems at all. We did have one problem with the gasoline support van that broke down, yeah. uh, but otherwise it was great. Mm -hmm. So there have been lots of reports, and you've had to deal with this, uh, and are trying to deal with it, about fires. And I mean, I assume that has to do with batteries. Uh, and what are you doing to make sure that the perception yeah, sure. is that Teslas are not safe? Yeah, absolutely. Well, uh, with respect to the fires, it's worth noting that um, all, all cars have some propensity to catch on fire, um, but our car is, is eight times less likely than a gasoline car. Hmm. So it's, it's, it's important to appreciate that no car is, is, is completely fireproof. Um, also, when uh, fires occur, they've only occurred after high-speed impacts. Um, and there have never been any injuries. In fact, our, our car is, um, I believe, uh, or at least Tesla is, is mm -hmm. certainly unique in, in that no one has ever had a serious injury in our cars ever under any circumstances. Mm -hmm. Is there a part of you, Elon, that feels a little redeemed today because there were people who were running, what's he thinking, what's he smoking, how is this going to work? Is there a part of you that feels redeemed today after what the cars have done? Um, I, I do. I think this is, this is an important uh, historic milestone uh, to be able to travel across the country essentially as conveniently as one could do with the gasoline car. Um, and it's, it's worth perhaps just saying, saying a bit about what our goal is with the superchargers. The superchargers are actually free to use forever for, for Tesla customers. So our goal is to provide free long distance travel throughout the country forever. And we're putting solar panels over the supercharger station. So mm -hmm. the basic idea is to be able to travel for for free forever uh, on pure sunlight. Yeah. I think many people believe that electric cars are the future. They, they'll have to be, and, and you're at the forefront of that transformation, and these are beautiful cars. They mm -hmm. are, but they're expensive. I mean, $71,000, and they're kind of more right. for, not necessarily for moms or... Well, I think know, they are, actually. Yeah, but, and, yeah. yeah so explain yeah. that. I mean, are you going to make a less expensive car to broaden the range? Yeah, there's, there's two pieces to it. There's the, the affordability, and I agree that the car is a little on the, on the high side. I mean, after various tax breaks, it actually takes down to about $60,000. And the fact that you can travel free long distance and your gasoline costs much less takes it down to a gasoline equivalent cost for probably about 50. But still, still too expensive for most people. Um, what we really need to do is get to our third generation car, which will be about half the price of the, of the, the Model S. It'll be a bit smaller. Um, and that's coming out in about three years. You, re um, you recently tweeted, though, uh, we were in there with your kids, five boys, which yeah. I know is a lot of activity, <laughs> right. that you're looking forward to a road trip with your wife and your five boys that's in a right. car. Yeah. What is the secret to how that's going to go? Well, uh, <laughs> if, if anyone's... <laughs> five cars. <laughs> yes, yeah, right. that's right. Um, well, uh, so as preparation, we, we did watch uh, National Lampoon's Vacation yes, with Chevy yes, Chase. Yes, great uh, movie. No dog yeah, on it, the it, top. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So you're ready. So, uh, yeah, exactly. I'm, I'm sure it'll be, yeah. there'll be some drama on the trip. Um, but but the, the Model S uh, is the only sedan that actually can take seven people. Um, mm -hmm. So it can take, uh, it has room for five adults, two kids, plus room in the front for, uh, and, for luggage. And lots of toys. Yeah, obviously, exactly. obviously cost is one, one question about yeah. electric cars. It, second is charging stations and yes. people having confidence that they're Absolutely. not going to run out of power. Yes. Mm -hmm. How far away are we from that? I think we're, we're getting quite close. So at this point, about 80% of, of the U.S. population is covered by superchargers. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, by the end of this year, we expect to be in the high 90s, so probably 95 to 98%. One wow. quick question yeah. for me, too, is this notion of space travel. What is it that you and Jeff and, and others are <laughs> no, we're really switching topics. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> right. are, are looking to do? What's your goal? Who's Jeff? <laughs> <laughs> right, sorry. Yeah. Well, just, the, the, we have some prior context. Yes. <laughs> but just, we do. Yeah. Well, there's other people at the table. <laughs> <laughs> right. So, um, what are you trying to do with, with, with space travel? Yeah. Um, okay. So, um, our, our, our goal with SpaceX is to improve rocket technology to the point where ultimately we can transport large numbers of people and cargo to Mars. Right. Yeah. 
This is going to sound like quite a non sequitur to a lot of people, but it is in the transport arena, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah. And the dude you're referring to is Bezos? Bezos, yeah. okay. Yes, yeah. Thank you. Richard Branson right. and yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay. All right, Elon. Congratulations. Thanks. Congratulations. You might want to talk to Sarah Jessica Parker on your way out because she asked for a card from one of your right. guys. I think she's interested. Well,